So my name is Taro Aoki, the head of the Digital Press uh, Solutions EMEA. I'm uh, charging for the, all the sales in the uh, Jet Press business and also the Digital Press business in Europe. So firstly, so let's have a look at our history of the Digital Press. So since from 2004, we created the concept how we can develop the digital press into the graphic art market. And then after this, the, we decided to acquire the Fujifilm Dematics. So for the head manufacturer, it's kind of the core technology of the digital press equipment. And then based on this, the, we launched the product at the Drupa 2008. It was kind of the technical review so not production itself, but uh, just showing how our technology is going ahead. So then after this, the 2011, we finally launched the Mark I machines, Jet Press 720, at the 2011. And then based on this experience, we enhance the technology as well as the features to the to 2014, and finally we launched the product 720F machines at the 2014. So then after this, we of course the implement several software <coughs> improvement, and also in together with this, we are learning a lot what customer want and what the customer need, and where we should to move for the digital press market. So during the, uh, since from 2014, that we launched the Mark II machine, 720F, that in the worldwide base, we already installed 100, more than 150 machines in the worldwide. <laughs> so let's say approximately 70 machines installed in Japan, and 40 machines each in Europe and the US. So let's say 50%, 25%, 25%, something like this. So all of the 150 customers is really happy to use the machine. And they are using quite a number of the applications and quite a number of the past time material, materials and product they are using by the jet press. And they are getting the profit from the jet press. So let's say they like a coffee table books and the photo book also and brochures, posters, and book covers, a lot of customers are using for the book covers and card and calendars. So not only this, but also the package segment that some of the customers are using for the jet press. So now the uh, application wise, quite wide range the, uh, of the application the jet press is now supporting. <coughs> so let's say how customer is saying in one word. So totally six word is mainly what customer is want to say for the jet press. One is the versatility and the uh, productivity and ultra high quality and also strong environment performance and profitable and proven technologies. So everything is very special and very helpful for the customer's business. So that's why we have to consider how we can use this advantage to the next generation. So firstly, we consider anyway JetPress will use for their production and the productivity itself is very important for their business growing. So that's why the productivity is most important rather than only chasing for the quality itself. <clears throat> so however, once we said the productivity. So a lot of competitors also saying we are supporting 3,200 sheet per hour, blah, blah, blah. However, the real meaning of the productivity itself is covering by this element. One is pre -press preparation and press uptime is really important. And press print speed is in that specification and also on the floor productivity. So these four elements we have to improve and to bring the new equipment 
into the customer site for his business. So this is a chart. The, this side is the run length, and this is the number of jobs. The, let's say the peak of the number of the customer jobs is around 3,000 run lengths, I have to say. However, many of the inkjet machine or toner machines is just covering very small piece of the whole total printing market. So for instance, even the JetPen 720 is covering this area. Let's say the 800, less than 800 sheet per sheet. Also a lot of competitor, <coughs> as well as the Xerox, Canon, like a POD devices also covering this area. However, once we encourage more to the printing market, to more going to the digital side, we have to establish new areas, so we call it the digital press zone. So by the new product, we are chasing to develop new area, new printing areas, instead of the print on demand zone where we are staying now. <coughs> so now 2018, so should be an exciting announcement. Without a doubt, the key feature of the Jet Press for us is the quality of the work that it produces. It's easily as good as Litho, if not better. We chose the Jet Press because of the uh, first, the quality, and B, the variety of different thick or thin papers that you can print on. The reliability and the colour consistency is a key feature and quite often people are complaining about colours changing throughout the run on big runs. With the jet press you don't get that, you won't get that. It's so reliable and the colour is accurate throughout. After the installation of the first one we um, decided very quickly, six weeks later I guess, uh, that we have to buy a second one because uh, the quality and uh, also the print speed um, is outstanding and we said okay that makes sense to buy a second one. Uh, we are really proud we will print the first time next week uh, for Porsche. You try to get such customer the whole time, this, this premium product and these nice pictures and you always will have the same problem. Everyone has the same technology. They, they just have to compare the price and anyone can print the same quality. I present the factory and they say, oh, strap truck, oh, you have a Fuji. There's no discussion, the quality is much better. One of the most interesting topics for us is that we can print posters, large format print posters, much more faster than in the past. For example, um, to produce um, um, one day production we needed in the past with um, 12 large format printers around about eight hours and uh, we are able now to produce this volume with the jet press within two hours. With book work on the jet press obviously with the variable data handling capability you can print sheets in collated order, guillotine them, put them through the perfect binder and you're done. It saves a whole load of processes. Both machines, they are running 24 hours, six or seven days in the week. Whenever I say I will get 20,000 sheets today, I will get them. And with other machines, maybe you get 23 or 30,000, but tomorrow is not working and you will get only 5,000 or zero. That's why we prefer, whenever we are trying to print seven days in the week, I need machines which always work which, um, like in offset, it will never break. Yeah? And uh, this is the situation we found with these kind of machines. The level of reliability of the Fujifilm JetPress 720S is uh, very, very good. We've also found the JetPress uptime is exceptional. Um, it's around 90%. We've recently done a job for a company within the aviation industry where previously they'd tried to get the quality that they wanted 
on a very dark tint, like an 85% tint of black uh, for a front cover of a brochure. They tried elsewhere to get it printed, both using litho and digital technology, and were unable to do so. As soon as they saw the results on the jet press, they were absolutely delighted with it. It's, it's for us possible now to make uh, short runs in high quality. Uh, we make folders, we make brochures in, in, in small quantity in a high, high quality. Um, also, we make displays, calendars, uh, collated on the, on the jet press. So we can produce economically, uh, yes, but much better than uh, before. A good example for the productivity of the jet press is, for example, we had a job last year. It was uh, nearly half a million sheets. We planned to print it on our B3 printing machine, but we had to deliver very fast. So we turned around to the jet press and could deliver in, in a very short time. Our reputation is based on quality and reliability. You know, sometimes you only hear when there's a problem. We're getting clients ring us up now, asking for the work to be produced on the jet press, even if it's a litho quantity. But the quality of the jet press is second to none, and the wide colour gamut system is amazing. JetPass gives us the opportunity to uh, get into new markets uh, because uh, it's a, a specific uh, machine who deliver short runs. So we can um, think and provide new products to lead the market. We don't have to follow the market. The Jet Press has enabled us to enter new markets. Now, simply, we can personalize a B2 sheet up to 400 gram, which is something we could never do before and not many other people could do before. A big part of the reason for our recent growth uh, was the investment in the two Fujifilm jet presses uh, late 2015. There was not uh, the situation to say we buy this one or the other one. Uh, for us, it was clear we have to buy a second jet press uh, because of the quality. The factory uh, today is the perfect, perfect situation. We have a completely new technology everywhere. Everything is growing, new customers are coming. We were at a point with the company where we knew we wanted to invest and it was a question of whether we invested in the existing litho kit, renewing that kit with slightly quicker, more modern machinery, or whether we wanted to open up a new market with the jet press. And that was a very clear option for us that that's what we wanted to do. So the customers expect from us short delivery times, they expect extreme high quality and um, they expect a perfect price. Uh, with the jet press we believe to be able to answer all these questions. With the jet press for me it's mainly about the quality of the print and the uptime. You know, I'm not worried about jobs, you can throw anything at me, it won't be a problem on the jet press. Would I recommend Fujifilm? Absolutely. From the outset, we took a short trip to Germany to see a jet press in action. The hospitality, generosity, information, knowledge shared by the Fuji directors and team have been amazing. Great bunch of guys and pleasure to deal with them. So today, so I proud to announce the 750 machines, the other brand new product and the premium product of the jet press series. So you will see afterwards the machine itself is also quite nice. So because we installed the machine at the last IGAS in Japan, however, it's first time to put the machine in the outside of the Japan. So you will be a first people to see the real machines. So inside of the machine, we implement a lot of things. So of course, we use the proven technology 
of the JetPair 720 to the 750 machines. But of course, we implement a lot of new technology and features inside of that. So Mark will explain more details. However, as you can see, that each highlighting point that we improve or we change there's something more or better. And you will see how this machine productivity and reliability is from now on. Also, in together with this, the machine will support, again, the package areas. The, we are now more focusing to the package segment by the JetWest 750. So this machine also supporting up to 600 micron folding carbon papers, as well as the Sina commercial paper. Also, we would like to announce the new food grade package ink. It's a special ink for the food grade ink. We already get a certification from the Swiss, like a Swiss ordinance and the European Commission regulation like this. It was also touched by the uh, mark later on. So not only the machine and the ink itself, but also we will introduce the new software color management tool for the XMF color pass brand color optimizer. So John will explain something more about this later, but due to these new features, the now we can support up to 90% of the Pantone colors by the four color jet press printing machines. And finally, I'm also very happy to announce these two customers, one from the Portugal, Floricara, and also one from Germany, Middelduk, has been decided to buy the jet press and both machines to be installed early next year. So thank you very much. And I hand over to Mark to explain some of the more details.